Hi, it's Benjamin with Safe Drive Solutions. Today we're going to talk about is a dash cam worth it? With so many drivers on the road, often I get asked, is a dash cam worth it? We're going to outline some of the benefits it can provide you. Hit and run claims. A hit and run is when an unidentified driver hits your vehicle or you are injured and leaves the scene of the collision. In BC Canada, ICBC states, if you are claiming vehicle damage and have an ICBC collision coverage, you will have to pay your chosen collision deductible, which could be as low as $300. If you have ICBC optional hit and run coverage, you'll have to pay a $750 deductible. So the question from Rain, is a dash cam worth it? Some of my clients have had their deductible waived by proving innocence with dash cam footage. Imagine being blamed for something you did, not do, and having to pay for it. Well, without a dash cam, you're definitely paying your deductible. With a dash cam, you will at least get a chance to tell your story. Obviously, I always recommend checking with the insurance company to finding out whether or not it is a possibility it would weigh in your advantage or not, but still, Capture evidence in the event of an accident. Having a silent witness on the road through dash cam recording can help prove fault in accidents. Knowing who is at fault can allow you to settle outside of court quickly so you can move on with your life. Dishonest drivers may flee the scene or lie when they realize they are at fault. Above all, without the dash camera, it makes it a lot harder to prove innocence. Imagine you're sitting at the stoplights and the car in front of you reverses into you. As a result, you are at fault and have no way to prove your innocence. A friend of mine, Dashcam just saved him from a 50-50 insurance claim. His dash camera proved he was going through a green light and not running a red. Therefore, without the footage, he would have been hoping for a witness to come forward. But because he had that dash camera footage, he was able to prove he went through a green and the other party was deemed at fault. So he did not have to pay deductible or anything at all. So these little things happen from time to time. Another thing is parents can monitor new car drivers. So I know when I was young, I had a heavy foot, drove a little aggressively, had a couple little accidents here and there. Nothing major, but, you know, just little things. But it would have been nice to have a dash camera, that kind of technology, so I could utilize it to, uh, you know, they could give me feedback on my driving, my aggressive behavior, my, you know, speeding, those kinds of, uh, that kind of information. So just one of the benefits of being that. So you can be proactive with your teen, you know, like, like I covered on a video before, we talked about if you had an interior camera, like a three-channel system, you could also monitor whether your, your child is playing with a phone while driving, not paying attention, right? Because you really don't want to have that. Those are very expensive tickets to say. And I mean, if a cop pulls you over saying they're playing with their phone and you have video footage to prove that you weren't playing with your phone, that's another thing that actually is can work in your favor by having that internal camera now vandalism now if you're worried about vandalism happening to your car a few things we recommend to get the best use out of a dash camera let us know so we can properly advise you on the best solution depending on your concerns to have 24-hour parking mode coverage if you're really worried about your vehicle being monitored 24 hours a day we recommend a power cell otherwise all the dash cameras that we pretty much carry without the power cell, the low battery protection will kick in. And when it kicks in, it's not going to capture any recordings after it's kicked in. Okay. Look at dash cameras that have motion detection or time lapse, which all the units that we currently carry do. Talk to your insurance company to find out if they will waive your deductible if you prove innocence on vandalism. Because I don't think a lot of insurance companies will if you're worried about extreme vandalism, okay? So you really want to make sure that. The other thing is, like I did bring up a power cell. If you don't drive your car every day, 
it will not charge up that power cell. Which means if you don't charge up the power cell, that means it's not going to record for all that time while parked because it's not getting charged. In turn, in the end, is a dash cam worth it? I think the decision is yours to make. I personally don't leave home without it. We have one in all the vehicles that are at our house. There's plenty of benefits that will assist us in our daily drive. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to ask or reach out. Cheers.